get ready with me for work. Okay, um, I'm already in my work outfit because I don't feel like changing when I get there. So that's why I'm wearing this bodysuit. This is the only work shirt that looks good on me. So I have to wear it. And I hate bodysuits so much. It's just like so uncomfortable. Okay, it's 9.40. I have to leave at 10. I don't start until 11. But I leave an hour early because I take the train and I like to go get my Starbucks. Really don't feel like wearing makeup today, but I think I will. I either like wear no makeup or I go like all out. So it really depends. Okay, I think I will go all out today. I'm just gonna do this like Charlotte Tilbury foundation. Okay, I normally hate foundation, but this foundation is super like light coverage. So I like it. I'm already so excited to go home. Like I'm home right now, but I'm excited to go home after my shift. That's how much I don't want to work today. Also, some of y'all asking me to do, like, fit checks while I make these. And I think I will, but my outfits are just, like, not it most of the days. Like, I wear sweatpants, like, almost every day. And honestly, I've probably worn, like, jeans five times in this whole entire school year. Like, I physically can't function with jeans. And why would I wear jeans when sweatpants exist? Like... I mean, like, I'll still do it, but I'm just telling y'all now, it's not going to be very entertaining. <gasps> I forgot concealer. Ugh, whatever. I swear, I always forget something when I'm doing my makeup. It's always, like, when I'm, like, halfway finished, too. Okay, I'm going to set my face. Okay, I have to go soon because I totally forgot. I have to ship out Depop packages, so I need to pack those still. And then drop them off at the post office. Okay, still need to clean up my eyelids, but it's my outfit today. Sweatpants. <laughs> um, this is my work shirt, and obviously these are not my work pants, but I don't feel like wearing my work pants right now. first day back at school i'm dreading going to school like i i don't want to go like at all i'm not even saying that just to be like oh like i hate school like i genuinely don't want to be there i'm using the frillian's illuminating drops because this is like the best i'm really hoping and praying some of my classes didn't switch because at my school um your classes can switch like depending on the semester like you can like have a different elective one semester and not the other i'm legitimately su surviving on like no joke like four hours of sleep max my cat archie kept me up all night and he i don't know why like i don't know what was the reason but he just didn't want to be in my room and i really couldn't fall back to sleep for like a good hour can't wait for summer like genuinely that's the one thing i'm really looking forward to um for the next couple months i also like spring break i guess because my birthday falls on spring break this year Spring break is like very short lived and summer is just feels like forever. I'm also just not looking forward to dealing with crappy teachers because half the teachers are always in like really bad moods and also the PDA in the hallways. I also please don't say anything about my self tan hands. I know they're really bad, but I'd rather be tan than pale. So I've like boiled down my makeup routine to like do it in less than 15 minutes. And I know for some people that's like a lot of time, but for me, that's like a really quick makeup. Like, and I'm really happy that I did because I need time to myself this morning to like prepare myself mentally for what I'm about to walk into. If you guys think I'm exaggerating, I'm really not like my school is just chilling like that bad. Like every day in those hours, like those six hours of school, like I'm just thinking about going home and like sleeping. Well, I was going to show you my cat, but he's just nowhere to be found because he just loves running around the whole house and destroying literally everything. A little hack I use is after my setting spray, I don't really like the powdered look, so I use like a dewy setting spray. And then when I'm done with like, all my makeup, I use setting spray. It like doesn't have any finish to it. It's just like a setting spray. And these two together like make the perfect like set makeup. Genuinely just feels so sick. Like I don't know what's wrong with me, but I just don't feel good. So I might like take something um, to like not be like this during the day because 
when I'm like not feeling good at school, it just makes my day ten times worse. Like I, like if I don't want to be there prior to me feeling sick, me feeling sick just makes it like thirty times worse. This is gonna be my lash combo today. Hopefully this does me good. Honestly, I think it did me fair. Um, it's good enough. I'm using a little bit of Benetton because I feel like with my tan, my lips need to look like extra pink. And then a little bit of the NYX in the shade Natural, just like lining my lips. And that's the makeup for school. I hope you guys have a better day than I do. Love you guys so much. Bye. Hey guys, get ready with me. So basically, for the past two days, I've been extremely ill. Look at my eye. I don't even know what happened there. I've literally got eye bags. I'm just so poorly. Oh my god, I've got one here as well. I don't even know what's going on. Anyways, today I'm feeling a little bit better. I wasn't feeling very good this morning, but now that I've took some ibuprofen and got in the bath, I feel a lot better. I haven't eaten in two days. I've only drank, like, water, so, yeah. So, I'm going to meet Samara, and we're going to go get some miso soup, because I love it, and I'm just craving it. And it has so many nutritional values, so I feel like that's a good thing to eat after I've not eaten for two days. And then after that, I'm going to meet Jack, and then we're literally just going to sit down and do nothing, because I can't bring myself to do anything. Like, I couldn't even walk, like, stand up this morning or walk down the stairs or nothing. Oh, I just feel so grim, and I've been sweating. My bed literally has sweat patches now, because the past two nights, I've just been sweating to myself off. I feel so freaking crusty. I've had this bonnet on for two days now. And my hair could have been bussing, bussing if I wasn't ill. But instead, it's been suffering in my bonnet for the past, I don't even know. I'm just going to shove my hair in a bubble. Oh, I really don't feel good. Okay, I've done it. I don't know if I can be bothered to do my edges. I think I might just leave. I'm going to put my puffy eye attack cream on because I've got black eyes and i have like little things around them so this needs to be sorted out asap oh guys i'm literally dying i'm dying i'm just really excited to get miso soup to be honest because it's literally my favorite thing and it's really nutritious it should make me feel better and it'll have loads of vegetables in it and i'll feel like an amazing queen this is the Bubble Slam Dunk Hydrate Moisturiser, by the way, guys. It's my favourite one that they have. I might get a boba as well. Oh my god, guys. I ordered a package and I ordered me and Jack, like, this boba glass. How cool is that? So, now I've got boba glass. So I have boba in because I was having problems. I really wanted boba, but I didn't have the straw. So obviously I can't have boba without a boba straw because then the boba won't come up. So then I just put the reusable one. And then we're bam. Boba. I'm just going to put some lip oil on. And then... Are we ready? I love you all. Mwah. Hey loves, get ready for school with me. Okay, so my hair is like day three hair and usually on day three, I love to do a half up, half down. But whenever I do it, it's always something that annoys me. Like this time, I feel like I'm not leaving enough hair down and I'm grabbing too much hair. But if I grab less hair, it won't pull up all the places that I need. And like this bit, like the bit that I'm holding here, it gets so like knotty. I think I got it good enough. And I'm gonna wear this bow. I'm just like really obsessed with these bows. I just think they're so cute. They're like claw clips, but bows instead. And I really love them. Now let's do my makeup because I have about 15 minutes left. I definitely spent a little bit more time than I should have on my hair. Also, people always say that they want like a skincare routine from me, but I kind of have two different ones. Like when I'm wearing makeup, my skincare routines are literally just like two moisturizers and a primer. That's what I'm doing right now. But then when I'm not wearing makeup, I do put like serums and toners and stuff now what i just use on my makeup is just la roche posay epicard duo my Levana like pink strawberry seed moisturizer and this photo is 
primer but that is usually just it that's all i put under my makeup because my makeup does tend to melt off yesterday i went out to brighton with my boyfriend and my sister because my mom was working so we had to bring my little sister with us we had did some shopping i bought some winter clothes i went to hollister and bought some jeans as well some new jeans i just really like hollister jeans i feel like my best jeans are from hollister so then i bought these black flares and i got home they fit me perfectly on the waist but the length was too short they were okay to wear with flat shoes but with heels which is probably what i would wear that with it was just too short so i do have to go get that changed we were also on a mission to find my boyfriend a coat because he doesn't have one because his one's like really really old he will not survive through this winter with it i found a perfectly good one in hollister like it was nice and it was like even fluffy inside and everything he was like i don't want fluff inside it i was like oh my gosh it's so stubborn and it was really really good coat it was a really nice fit and it was really fluffy it was really warm it was like one of their warmest coats and um he didn't want it so then we went to zara men's and we tried on some of their coats there and they were okay they were very like boxy like they were really big on the shoulders he just looked like a big blob so yeah we ended up not finding him a coat so yeah we're gonna see if we can find some online but again i feel like we could still like risk the boxy situation some people can rock it but my boyfriend could not like he's like really skinny and tall and then it was just like a big ball so you just look like a lollipop that's what it looks like if you guys have any like recommendations for, like men's coats obviously affordable because we're still trying to look for one so let me know but anyways i've got to go now so i love you all so much and i hope you all have an amazing day bye yesterday at school literally sucked um i cried in school and i hate crying in school and i did and it's annoying and i have to go through all of school today and i just i really hate that school i hate the school i hate school in general but i really hate that school like i can't stand being there the kids in there are so annoying the teachers are just boring it's i hate it yeah i'm literally gonna beg to switch to online school because i can't stand my school it's a different type of hatred like like it's just like oh i don't like school nobody likes school. no i don't like school brilliant i hate arguing with people but i'm not taking any amount of disrespect ever so i'm gonna argue with you if you disrespect me if you're even the tiniest bit sassy i'm arguing with you and who hugged up sassy men in 2023 because that was not cute it was funny for a little bit but when men actually started to become sassy that's not cute i need to calm down i just how i feel like i genuinely hate the place hate the people like there's nothing enjoyable ever about that place and i just i don't want to be there like, at least now i can say i graduate in two years but like does it really matter does it really matter because it's two years are going to be horrible and also for so many people i'm not obsessed me talking about how badly i got hurt is not being obsessed i was literally hurt but for the rest of you who choose to watch and love me have a great day i love you so much bye Hey guys, get ready with me for school. This is actually my first get ready with me in 2024 because I just like have not posted the past few days, but I'm back. My first day of school, like back from break, was yesterday and it was so horrible. Um, yeah, we could know. Also, like, I just don't feel good. Like, I'm pushing through because I just don't have the time to be sick, but like, ugh. It honestly just feels weird, like, writing the date at school, like, not even just 2024, but, like, the fact that it's January is just weird. But, like, it's that time of year where it's, like, you just have to make it to the weekend. Like, every single week, you're literally counting down the days. Because the weekends, like, they're fun, like, obviously. I love the weekends. But, like, school is just so intolerable. And there's so many tests right now, and, like, midterms are coming up, and, like, ugh, so stressful. I like love doing my makeup in the morning just because like makeup is literally therapy and whatever but don't have the time like it's 7 5 i should be downstairs because i just sleep way too late because i hate getting up it's okay because i don't feel pretty for the rest of the day because i have mascara on. i just i need to go but i just don't want to and it's like i have chem first period which like i don't even mind like why am i like that sorry the lighting got myself in the but, like, my teacher's really nice, like, I have friends in my class. But then it's, like, the rest of the day. This guy just called me. I get really thrown off when people call me. Like, don't call me. It's 7 in the morning. Okay, I need to go downstairs. So, bye, guys. Thanks for watching. My first good meet of 2024.
Hello everybody, get ready with me to go to dance. This is also the first get ready with me of 2024. It sounds so weird saying 2024 now. I, don't I was going to do a get ready with me yesterday, but my mum decided to wake me up so early because she had to go somewhere. So I didn't even get ready yesterday. I chucked on the tracksuit and then I just stayed in that all day. Tonight I've got ballet first for an hour and then I have tap and then I have chart dance, which is similar to like commercial. This is my outfit for ballet today. I've got this cute little set on. I think it's from Block. I'm just going to put a tiny bit of my pro filter on because my body's like really tanned and I forgot to do my face last night because I'm so stupid. So I look really pale now. I also freshly washed my hair last night and now I've got to put it in a ballet bun. So that's just not fun. I've lost my beauty blender, guys. Never mind, guys, I found it. I've got a really fun shoot tomorrow with my favourite dancewear brand. So I'm really excited for that tomorrow. I never ever do get ready meals for dance because usually when I have school, I just go straight from school to dance. So I never normally come home. In between school and dance, I usually just go straight there. I don't know if I've actually told you this, but my mum's my dance teacher because she used to be a professional dancer when she was younger and she owns her own dance school now, so she teaches me. I feel like I barely post about dance and I'm going to start doing it a lot more this year because it's such a huge part of my life. I do it most days of the week and I've done it since the age of two, so basically my whole life. I'm just setting my under eyes so that they don't crease. Guys, I slept through till one o'clock today. Like I did not wake up in between. I just slept until one. And I set an alarm at 8.45 and I just slept through it until one. I haven't tinted my eyebrows in so long. I don't know how they're still dark. Like, I don't know what's going on. That is all my makeup done for dance. And now I've just got to put my hair in a ballet bun. Bye, guys. Hey guys, get ready with me for the first day of school. I'm actually going to a public high school in the city I was born. And sorry if I'm talking oddly because I have teeth whitening strips in. I'm super excited because my parents aren't making my brother and I go to private school anymore. I only have a little bit of hyaluronic acid left, but it's fine. I'll pick up some more. I was up all night stressing out about school. And so I had the worst sleep of my life. But I also only have one friend at the school. I literally met that friend at a mall because she said she recognized me off of TikTok. She's actually going to be introducing me to people she knows at school, so I think that's very nice of her. Of course, when I need to like look decent, my skin starts peeling from the sunscreen. Oh, and by the way, I use the CoverGirl eyeliner for my waterline and then like this NYX like color corrector stick, I think, for contouring my nose. I have to leave in 10 minutes and I'm not even close to being done. So I'm going to speed rush. I'm going to try out this color changing lip oil real quick. I got it at Sephora the other day in LA. So I'm super excited about that. Okay, I'm not late, but at least I finished my makeup. Hey guys, get ready with me. Happy New Year's guys. I feel like this year is honestly going to be so good and I cannot wait to show you guys all the stuff I have in store. Okay, so for this New Year's, I wrote a bunch of resolutions that I want to complete by the end of this year and I'm so excited to show you guys. Like some of my New Year's resolutions are already coming true and it's literally so insane. Also guys, last week at Brandy was like literally so hectic. We had like over 30 boxes that we had to put out and we didn't even start on any. And on my way leaving from my job, I met a couple of you guys, and you guys are so nice. And I'm sorry that I'm so awkward. Like, guys, I'm literally such an awkward person, so if you guys see me, I'm sorry. Like, it was a fun interaction and just experience all around, and I love you all so much. But with that being said, I have a little haul to show you guys later, and I can't wait to show you guys everything I got. I got a bunch of stuff from Sephora, and I also grabbed a couple of things from Brandy. I'm just going to put on a little bit of this. And that was all today, and be on the lookout for that video later. Bye, guys.